Take a look. Faces of the missing. In this week's People magazine, missing children from across the country are highlighted as families tell their stories. News Channel 5's Jesse Knutson reports that Murfreesboro teen Devin Bond is one of the missing who's featured and his mom hopes will help bring him home. Yeah, I mean, when Heather Simmers was asked if she would be willing to talk about her son with People magazine, she said it was a no brainer. I was like, absolutely, because that's what we've been kind of working towards for a while is just to try to reach a nationwide audience. Devin Bonds is one of eight stories that were told in this week's magazine, shedding light on a truly alarming issue. More than 400,000 children were reported missing last year. While most of them make it home, some don't. Sometimes you run away and they think, they'll come back. Um, my son's been missing almost two years. He hasn't come back and he's listed as a runaway. Heather doesn't like the word runaway. Instead, she thinks they should simply be labeled as missing children. And when a child goes missing, she believes it should be one of law enforcement's top priorities to find that child. But in her case, tips and clues have all led to dead ends. And she doesn't believe Devin is still in Tennessee. So she's been doing everything she can I go to the post office every Monday and send flyers that go all across the country. To get his face out nationwide. That's the struggle with when you're trying to search for someone is just to get it out. To, how do you get it out to every state? Um, I wake up every morning asking that question, like, how do I get this out? How do I, you know, share his information with more people? How do I get more people to know about him? She hopes that being in people will help bring Devin home. But even if not, she plans to keep searching. I'm not going to stop. I mean, I can't give up on my child. I'm not going to. I can't. I don't know how. Jesse Knutson, News Channel 5. Of course, if you have any information on Devin Bond's whereabouts, you should call the sheriff's office.